Hello everyone, I'm Bindu Trika, Assistant Professor, IMS Ghaziabad. In this video, we would be learning about and uh, priority encoders. Previous video, we had learned about encoders. Priority encoders. A priority encoder is a combinational circuit that is similar to an encoder. In an encoder, we have discussed that uh, out of the n input lines, only one input is active at a particular point of time. Whereas in a priority encoder, out of n input lines, any number of lines can be high at a particular point of time, but the output depends on the highest input which is activated. Say I0 and I2, both are active at a particular point of time then the output would depend on the input i2 rather than input i0 that is priority would be given to the input i2 so in priority encoder a priority is given to highest order input line and based on this input line the output is generated now let us consider a 4 to 2 binary priority encoder here we have four input lines and two output lines there is one one more output line that is valid valid tells us whether the output is valid or invalid uh, for four input lines the possible we have 16 possible combinations in the first combination 0 0 0 0 all the inputs are active low that means whatever output we are getting is invalid. So y1, y0 would be 0, 0 and valid is also 0. In all other cases, sequence number 1 to sequence number 15, there is at least one input that is actively high. So the, our output would be valid. So in this, we have 1 to 15, all the valid entries are 1. Now output would be say uh, in the first row we have uh, sorry uh, second row we have 0 0 0 1 so 1 is a high value i0 is high based on i0 the output would be 0 0 in next call, uh, row we have 0 0 1 0 i1 is high the output is 0 1 in third row uh, in fourth row, we have 0, 0, 1, 1. Now, we have I0 as high and I1 as high. But priority would be given to I1 since it's a highest number. So, output would be based on I1 that is 0, 1. In next fifth row, we have input as 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0. So, I2 is high. The output would be 1, 0. In next row, we have... 0, 1, 0, 1. There are two actively high input lines, I0 and I2, but priority is given to I2. Similarly, in next line also, I2, I1, both are active high, but priority is given to I2 and output is 1, 0. In next line, we have three ones, 0, 1, 1, 1. And I0 is high, I1 is high, I2 is high. But priorities would be for I2, so output is 1, 0. In all the remaining rows, I3 is the highest number that is actively high. So output is 1, 1 for all the remaining rows. Because 3 is equivalent to binary 1, 1. It is now very much clear from the truth table we have designed that how we have got this particular output. Now based on this output, we would be having a KMAP simplification for Y1, Y0 and valid. For Y1, we have uh, two groups of eight members each. The equation for Y1 comes out to be I2 plus I3. Next, we have the K map for Y0. Based on the values of Y0, we would be having this particular K map. Here, we would be having two groups. One for eight members and second group would be for two members. The equation comes out to be Y0 is equals to I3 plus I2 dash I. Then we have KMAP for valid. The KMAP for valid is
now we would be having four groups of eight 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 members each first group then the second group then the third group and then the fourth group and based on this grouping the equation for valid comes out to be i0 plus i1 plus i2 plus i3 now since we have the uh, equations for y1 as i2 plus i3 y0 for uh, y0 is equals to i3 plus i2 dash i1 and valid is i0 plus i1 plus i2 plus i3 the circuit diagrams comes out to be we would be having four uh, sorry three and uh, three or gates one or gate corresponding to y0 y1 and valid each and we have four input lines i0 i1 i2 i3 now since valid is i0 plus i1 plus i2 plus i3 the circuit diagrams comes out to be this so valid we have all the inputs as uh, comes co are coming to our valid or gate then for y1 the equation is i2 plus i3 we have i3 uh, going to y1 and uh, to the or gate and then we have i2 going to the or gate uh, giving us the desired output for y0 we have i2 dash i2 dash we have inserted a not gate and i1 i2 dash i1 is both the inputs are going to a and gate and these and gates would in turn be going to the y0 and the second output for input for y0 is i3 here it goes and this is the desired circuit diagram for 422 priority encoder this is all about 422 priority encoder thank you thanks a lot